leprechaun from this time last year. And stories of ill treatment of young sons. Stuart the Dragon Slayer writes from Darwin Road in Tilbury and said, uh, Robbie, last week I received severe beatings from my funky mum and she says that mums and dads rarely get mentioned on your programme and it's about time they did. So please save me from my weekly Saturday morning bash and say hi to Molly and Barry English, otherwise known as mum and dad, also to Zoe and Debbie, Antonella and Zoe's sister Sue and tell Sue to keep up the funk in her dancing. Thanks millions. I hope I've saved you from beatings, Stuart. If it continues, let me know and I'll send the RSPCA round immediately. And Roy writes from uh, Tulls Hill, and it's mend a broken heart time. He's trying to get in touch with Yvonne, and all I know about Yvonne is she's 21. Is that you? Lives in Labrook Grove, works in a hotel, and last Saturday was wearing an orange jacket and an orange skirt, and danced with Roy at La Beetroot. Now, Roy says he's uh, anxious to get back in touch with you, mystery Yvonne. And if you get in touch with me, I can tell you where to find him, because I have his phone number. So if you were at Love Be True last Saturday, and you had an orange jacket on, your name's Yvonne, you're 21 and you danced with Roy, he's trying to find you again. 24 after 12, this time last year...
links and intuition. And they're busily, of course, auditioning a new bass player and vocalist for the band, and also are harder work in the studio for a new album to come later this year. Intuition from this time last year. And Robbie, could you play something funky and say hello to my wife Sue from Sunderland, who's in London town this week, and I hope that a large dose of the programme will put her in the groove, and also say hi to Peter and Anne from Welling Garden, and that comes from Jim in Hatfield, must see his wife about once a year. And uh, I'm afraid it's a mega message, Robbie, please, uh, every way but loose, which we played uh, early on, to the Funkatanga tourists especially the Staines branch, including Mako and Cruncher and Nug and Sniffer and Grizzo and Helmet and Pete and Bunny, Nookie, Juicy Jane, Bam Bam, Steptoe, Rufus, the Funky Mum and Dee and Jackie the Bullet, the Newbury Girls, the Girls from Bracknell, Camberley, the Feltham, Hounslow and Wimbledon branches, and not forgetting new recruit Selvin from Chelsea. And there's a little note on the bottom and it says, interviews for new Funkatanga tourist tarts will be held every Friday night at Chertsey Lock. You are listening to... <laughs> The Robbie Vincent Show. And from this time this year, from Clear's album, my favourite track. And don't forget, still to come, we've got three from three big American artists soon to be in town. Plus some killer newists. Do not go away. The album's called Taste the Music, clear. And don't forget, if you're Yvonne with the orange jacket and the orange skirt, give me a call and I'll put you in touch with uh, Roy. And mend a broken heart. And correspondence from uh, Wokingham Road, Reading in Berkshire, nicely typed out. Uh, hi to Porky, Jen and Tracy, who frequent Bracknell College. Also, hello to Uncle Wally Collin, Victor Giraffe, as in neck, uh, Keith the... Uh, Paul Swabby, and last but not least, presume the pose Shane from the Woodley Jazz Men, Roy and Keith, who get a prize for good uh, handwriting. And Elaine says, could you um, wish my friend Helen a happy birthday? She's in Horsham. It was her birthday on the 26th of February. Happy birthday to you, Helen. And uh, could you play a uh, second image? I haven't got it in the show this week, but I hope, uh, Helen, you're going to like this one anyway wonderful Detroit spinners. Don't forget we have an all-winner show coming in two or three weeks' time. Make sure you get your all-winner nomination in soon.
Detroit Spinners, Knack for Me, and maybe the Detroit Spinners could be uh, one of your favourite artists, and you have a classic you'd like to hear on the All Winners Show, which is in three or four weeks' time. And if you have a favourite record over the past 150 years, uh, put it on a postcard, and can you mark to help me on the front of the postcard, the All Winners Show, care of Robbie Vincent, Radio London, 35A Marylebone High Street, London West 1. We've had some really interesting suggestions in so far. It's lovely to be remem reminded of some of these records I've totally forgotten about. If you have a winner, drop me a line and nominate it, and who knows, you might hear it in three or four weeks' time. That's for Helen on her birthday in uh, Horsham from Elaine, alias The Little Known. And talking about Second Image, uh, they're live on stage uh, tomorrow at Tiffany's in Dunstable, and I'm alive on stage at <laughs> Tiffany's in Dunstable tomorrow some Sunday funking <coughs> some Sunday funking to the left of the M1 if you're going up north and to the right of the M1 if you're coming down south that's uh, tomorrow Tiffany's in Dunstable War have got a new album just out
title track of the new War album, Outlaw. That's for uh, Vince Mouthlandy, the founder member of the All Transport Limited Funky Shipping Clarks. Wish him all the best in his new job from the Toad Down the Bannister Appreciation Society, alias Donut Wiggin, Stitches Sing and Grumpy the Manager. All right, must mean something to somebody. Three in a row from three big American acts coming to town. Details of where you can see them and when they're playing in a few minutes. This is for Jane, Jane and Kay, three hard-working girls in the city at this very moment. Afternoon, girls.
Coming to town three in a row. Three acts that'll be in town in the next couple of months. And uh, the Mays track, and of course Mays, and all these gigs, by the way, at the Hammersmith Odeon. Mays, 22nd, 23rd of March. 22nd is sold out. Uh, but the 23rd, there might be one or two tickets left. And the Mays track was uh, especially for Paul and Ron and Terry and the two Marks and the two Garys at Archer's Wine Bar in Gideon Park, Romford. Thank you, girls. Got your note. I'll pass it on to Frankie Beverly. And before that... Professor Donald Bird at Hammersmith Odeon, the 17th and the 18th of April. Ticket prices, three, four and five pounds. Box office for that opens on March 5. 
and Tom Brown's coming to town on April the 2nd and April the 3rd, also at Hammersmith Odeon. Box office is already open for that. And I have two double tickets to give away for the Tom Brown concert next Saturday. They're coming to town. Tom Brown, Professor Donald Byrd and the Amazing Maze. This man has got plans. He plays funk. Stand by for some of the big newies through till two. Pie. One way. As for Mary cooking the dinner, 
And also for the Crowthorn Funketeers, especially Ashley and Chris, partial to a weekend in Belgium, Ted, and partial to a dog, Dave. We hope Dave liked the present we gave him down at Splinters on Friday, Wolf Wolf. And no, you're, you haven't got enemies in the post office, and no, we don't use requests as uh, beer mats. It's the luck of the draw. And from Igloo number 33, Snow Street, Ice Town, Oslo in Norway, could you play a hot, funky record for my sister Gay on the 27th? That's today. No doubt she'll be suffering from an excess of orange juice as it was her 21st birthday party last night. Happy birthday to you, Gay. And unfortunately, I cannot be there as Santa's reindeer was booked for the night delivering copies of the Heatwave LPs to every Igloo in town. By the time you get this letter, maybe I will have chipped the ice from my turntable to actually play some funk and make myself even more homesick in this land of thermal underwear and string vests. They are gay, Mark, even though he's miles away. In the land of ice and snow, he still remembers you. Four after one, it's a Saturday. The sound of soul, the sound of funk and the sound of jazz.